vaca. Oye, me pa ¿Qué rollo, mis pantuflitas voladoras? Hey, welcome to another show, another day. Vamos a ver chingazos. So, guess what? Remember, I told you I was gonna work on the pitufín again. So, here it is. El pitufín. Back into surgery, so I'm taking it to the shop right now. Remember, I told you about the rear brakes que también estaban cambiarse. So, today is the day. We're gonna replace them. Ahorita vamos a llegar a O'Reilly's, este, a uh, agarrar eso and rent the tool, because I don't wanna go through what I did last time. Duró un chingo y neta si hubiera tenido todo ahí. Or I might just buy the tool. I mean, I don't really need it because I don't really change brakes. I don't even do my own damn cars, but damn, I'm doing my wife's. I always pay for my own vehicles. Pero aquí ando haciendo el de mi esposa. So let's get it there. Like I said, we're going to get to O'Reilly's. Get those all pads. And then, pues yeah, start working. We also brought a little... La verga. Medicine cabin. Te voy algo trae suelto. I heard it. I heard it slamming. We, we took the we brought the medicine cabinet and uh, we're gonna pretty much restore it. Yeah, because we couldn't find one. We went to Lowe's, we went to Home Depot, and we had to order one, and it takes forever. And yeah, so we're gonna order one. But for now, I'm just gonna make this one look kind of pretty decent. Because I mean, it's not bad. It's just old. My house is old, so it came with the house, I guess. And so that's why everything has to be custom made, doors and everything. I think it's on the 50s from that, that my house right now. And we're actually, stay tuned because we are gonna start, we are actually, we are looking for another house. We do wanna buy a newer house and that's what we're looking for. We're just waiting on a few things, get on the bank approval, see how much they approve us for. I mean, that's not, I know they're gonna approve us for some good amount of money, but we're not just gonna, you know, go into debt for a lot of money. Porque no se madres no se pagan solas and it's a real long term uh, commitment. But yeah, so let's get to O'Reilly's, get those pads, and I'm gonna show you, like I said, another video of the Pitufin and how I'm gonna pretty much paint and restore that that medicine cabinet and do some shows because the other ones were glass and with kids they didn't last. So let's get it. All right, guys, we got them. So the total for all this was a hundred. Well, no, sorry, sixty-four ninety-four, and then thirty-one twenty-two. So uh, like, uh, like almost hundred dollars for brake pads. I ended up buying the two. Dije, yeah, la verdad, está rentando, está pidiendo. That that ain't me. So you know what? Even though if I don't really use it ever again, at least I know I'll have it in case I need it. In case I ever need it again. Because, I mean, the GMC, well, I haven't done the brake pads on those. I need to do them on the Rumblebee. But usually, you know, you get a screwdriver, you just press that thing in there, that caliper, and you call it a day. But for some reason, this little car, pinche morero, se pone, se pone medio especialón, y we gotta get that tool. And I don't really want to mess with that too much. I just want to get that done and, you know, get it over with. So... I mean, I'm, I'm out of the bottom, so I'm gonna change them anyways. Maybe they were crystallized or whatnot, but we're changing them now. And that's gonna come out on this video. A ver cómo batallamos. <laughs> so, ya aquí venimos, ahora sí. Vamos al taller. Get some, some to eat, some breakfast. Almorzamos. And si llega Jale, pues we'll have to put a hold on this car. Si no llega Jale, que es under surgery right now. So let me get there. Y es más, ahí nos vemos en corto. So, guys, we're back. Allá llegamos al taller, as you saw. We got the car inside. Ahora sí, I'm not gonna make the same mistake twice like last time, so loosen up the lug nuts before I lift the car porque no quiero que pase lo de otra vez que estaba batallando, so we got the cruceta it's only gonna be the rear brake, so it's gonna be a lot easier so let me get on it Fuel to the top, gotta fill the benches. In my 
thoughts obsession I will not stop, no, I'm never second guessing I got a God complex Haters love to hate, but I never feel pressed Got a lot on my plate, but I never get stressed I'll take all the pressure like I'm mason this test oh, Tear it up like I'm Jason I see the world like it's ready for the taking No, my man Wait, you're not cansado Those damn things were tight So, yeah, but ya los, ya los hicimos losing up I don't know if I'm gonna do one by one and then, you know, do like that so I don't have to put it on jack stands. But, pinche carrillo. Ya la segunda vez y. No mames, me sacó todo el aire. So, déjame la sigo esta madre. Because we need to get it done. Oh, and I gotta, like I said, restore that shit right there. So, today it is a busy day, hopefully. We get a little bit of uh, work afterwards, but if not, a darle. guys so check this out damn these things were gone like honestly check this out compare them to the new one look at this look at that brand new Ooh, that's a mac damn no mind man it's been almost an hour and a half question barely barely I barely got it done. This car is a pain in the ass. I'm regretting it starting in on it already anyways. But we're here. So we gotta finish it. Ya llegó el Jesús. Que raya pa! Ahorita le tomamos video para que vean como te siento restore esa madre. Ahí déjenme le sigo porque neta ya la pinche cabeza me Alright guys, so we are moving on to the next. Check this one out. It is nice. It is a Mustang. I believe it's a Mac. I don't know. But you know more than me. YouTube always knows more than anybody else, so comment down below in the comments what it is. So let me know what year and model this Mustang is porque está suave. I mean, it is nice. And even to open the hood is a pain in the ass. I couldn't figure it out. I'm not a Ford guy, so I didn't really know. But I did this uh, system install a while back. The guy painted the car. Unfortunately, his system wasn't uh, working. We already figured out what it was. We fixed it. I already tuned the radio and everything, retuned the amp because it did swap out the amp. To a different one he also um, got his own wiring I, pre I put my own wiring I think when they were painting it he told me that they accidentally just pulled everything out so he went and bought some Walmart wiring nothing against them but the fuse holder that it had from Walmart didn't uh, really hack it it burnt it broke whatever it's those little cylinder ones so we swapped it out put everything back the way it needs to be and now it's working so now I'm looking for a freaking Phillips uh, screwdriver because I need to remove the radio. Be not because what they end up doing, they, like I said, they took everything apart because they painted the whole interior, they upholstered and everything. But now the radio doesn't hold the memory. So one of the wires wasn't connected properly. Now I got to figure it out. So let me get to it. So guys, we're done. Check it out. Damn it, boy very very clean mustang all the way around i mean check this check it out neta it is nice i'm not a ford guy like i've always said i mean i have a chrome vic these cars are nice new mustangs they're nice too but i wouldn't buy one 
Pero ahí está ya. Él está en el cliente por él. Right now we gotta go to Lucky Motorsports and um, pretty much they, they need me to fix some Mustang. So, ironic shit. We gotta go check it out because apparently the radio's not working. It is a newer Mustang, so we gotta see what's up. Y luego, come back to the shop. Maybe I'll probably do that one tomorrow, not today. Because I do got a few things more to do. I already finished my wife's uh, car. Yeah, pinche pito fin. Neta que putiza me acomodé. Pero yeah, it's done and it's ready to go. So let me buckle up this Mustang, call the customer so you can come pick it up, and let's move on to the next. Ya está mis pantuflitas, pues, I guess today it is, it's already like almost 3.30. So it is the end of the day, ya el otro Mustang no me lo trajeron, no me lo trajeron estos vatos. Ya se llevaron el otro Mustang, so, we're gonna end this video here. Porque aquí también anda el novio del Jesús. Miren, ¿dónde Ya le está hablando, eh. Me prestas poquita leche, no sé qué le dijo. Ya estás peinado, chiquito cariñoso. Sí, ahí dejaste el trapo también, va, güey. Ahora le pues, ya estás gordito, fiu fiu. Love you forever. ¡Oh! ¡Eh, qué hubo! Piensan que es mentira y no es mentira, mi gente. Ahí está, que va a ser interesante. Mira, mira. Arre, arre, thank you, güey. Y se pone rod sin rodilleras, así a la brava. Okay. Eh, ¿Qué es lo que compró este vato? Un Corvette. So, mi gente, como les dije, gracias por, por mirar el canal. Thank you so much. Like and subscribe, ya se la saben. A ver, mijo, despídete. Gente, sigan a mi compa el Rudy. No se les olvide, por favor. ¿Ya lo oyeron? ¡Estamos! <risa>